Um, the task to be a um, mechanic, it varies. Um, you could be a refrigeration, conveyor, build a mechanic. Our job is mainly to keep it going, <laughs> make sure that it doesn't stop. And if it does, we have to be there to fix it. When I come in, I grab a cup of coffee. My lead or fleet manager will give me a work order to work on a truck or a trailer. We'll go and we'll pull the unit in and we'll start going to work on it. You get to know the drivers, you get to know the uh, trans managers. We all get along and we try to help the drivers out as best as we can and they appreciate our work. Your skilled trade is always in demand. It's not all just, you know, hand tools and, um, and grease. It involves, you know, computerized equipment, understanding logic. Every single day, one of the things I have to use the most is a laptop to be able to read all the fault codes and everything. Anybody could really do this if you really want to do it. You just have to have an open mind and then just be willing to learn. I'm a veteran. My military career wasn't transferable to a civilian life. And so I had to learn a trade, and someone gave me the opportunity to be a ammonia refrigeration operator, and I never looked back. What's nice about being here is that they always have everything you work on. You work from trailers to refrigeration units to trucks, so there's always something different. They basically put me through all the training I needed. Well, my mentorship comes from the refrigeration guy's name is Grayson. Very knowledgeable. We had a young individual come in uh, he was a skilled mechanic. I could always go talk to him. He's mentoring me through refrigeration. So once we got, got him past the basics, we decided to go ahead and send him to school so he can become certified. That was a life-changing opportunity because Gordon Food Service actually paid for my education. They really did. This company is an opportunity-driven company. They want the best and the brightest. And if you show them you're the best and the brightest, you will always succeed. If you get trained well and you become competent, you basically have a job for life.